Hey guys, it's Matt here from Scoop in Response. Good to be back after a bit of an extended break. Today we're going to be looking at a gameplay uh, video that I was lucky enough to play with Dylan and Cameron from Play to Win. So we got up real early one morning uh, because of the time differences and managed to get a few games in. Uh, I was joined by our local legend, uh, Brandon, uh, Bbot Online. Uh, and we played, I think, three games. So I'm going to be uh, showing you guys this one. We played a few other games as well. It was really, really sweet uh, to play some games with the absolute legends over there. Uh, they are super chill and... Uh, yeah, it was some really fun and different games uh, to be played. I'm going to draw a card. I am going to play Scalding Tarn. Crack it right away, going down to 39. I'm going to get the blue green one. Trump uh, Island. Trump Island and cast Carpet of Flowers. Those proxies are pretty. Sweet. Thank you. My favorite one about this, my favorite thing about this Carpet of Flowers is that. I don't know what happened with my printer, but it's now <laughs> highlighted so that I remember what kind of mana to make. That's pretty good. <laughs> so it works See, out. I didn't um, know there were proxies. I just thought they were the next secret layer. Oh, no, no, they're proxies. Cool. All right. I'm going to draw a cut. I'm going to deploy a overgrown tomb, shocking it into 38. I will then deploy this soul ring. Um, and if that's fine, I'll be passing the turn after that. I will draw a card. Let's go Windswept Teeth, fetch, 39, finding a Tundra, cast Ponder. Yeah, sounds good. Ponder good. Look at the top three. Hmm. Those are boring. <laughs> I'm going to shuffle. And draw a card. Pass turn. I'll play an Exotic Orchid, play a Jewel Lotus, and I will play Mystic Remora. I will okay. pass the turn. We'll go to my turn. Draw. On my first main phase, I will target Dylan, make a white mana. I'll you I'll play a land for turn. And I'll use that white mana in this tropical island, and I'll cast an Aether Sworn Canonist. Um if that resolves, I will pass a turn. Right, I'll tap. I'll keep. Draw. Cast an ignoble high arc, and that is my spell for the turn. Untap. Draw card. Let's go with Marsh Flats. Fetch. Going down to 38. I'll find a Badlands. I will cast Will the Wise. Seems good. ETB, would anyone else like to investigate? If you do, I will investigate also extra. And if you don't, you'll take one damage. I actually will investigate. I'm going to take a damage. I will refuse to investigate. Uh, so Matthew and Cameron, you guys each take a damage, and I will make two clue tokens. There's and a clue. Is that your spell for turn, I take it? There's two. That's my spell. Pass my turn. That's a draw. A fishy, a fishy, Matt. Oh, right. Sorry. I think I can just let it die because of the canonist. All right. I'll play my flats. Uh, I'll crack it. Go to 38. We'll go and get an underground C. I will cast a talisman of resistance. If not, that Good. is okay. I will cast a Fin on Elves, taking a damage, going to 37. And that will be my turn. I'm gonna fetch at the end of your turn, going down to 37. Yeah, I'll just go get a scrub land. All right, untap, upkeep, draw, carpet of flowers. Whoever wants to be the target, you can call dibs, I guess. Dibs. Uh, okay, Dylan. Don't you um, wanna play around brainstorm days? <laughs> uh, good call. Okay, so uh, <laughs> um, I guess that I'll target Dylan. Uh, I'm gonna make a a white mana with that. Um, we'll play a tundra as my land for turn. We'll use that floating white um, and this specific land here, and we'll cast a null rod. Oh. I will respond to that if that's okay. Please. I'm going to pay two and crack the clue. Good okay. call. Then I will be fine with letting that null rod result. All right, so null rod is in play. We'll also put out as my non-artifact spell, uh, Thalia, Guardian of Thraven. Then uh, we are going to send, uh, what's Will's power and toughness? Will, oh, sorry, Will's a one-two. 
Will's a one, two. Okay. That's unfortunate. Um, Dylan, I'm going to hit you with the cannonist for two. I'll take two. Going to 36. I will pass the turn. I'm tapped. I'll keep a draw. Okay, we'll play late for turn to start with. Um, I'm going to fetch to start with. Go to 37. Grab this tundra from my misty green forest. So I may as well contribute to this absolute mess and I'll play a Drowned Magistrate. No one is to have fun. <laughs> um, I will pass the turn on to... Untap. Draw a card. Let's see here. One spell a turn. I got a City of Brass as my land for turn. And... I can cast my commander. How about a two mana preordain? That's a lot, I think. That is a lot. Thalia makes it cost two. No red, Aetherstorn, and Dranath don't care about it. Preordain okay? Seems good. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I will scry two. One on top. Is that really even good? Not really. There's an old rod. Okay. Let's put them both at the bottom. And draw a card. Okay, I got seven in hand, and I will pass my turn. Draw a turn. Pass Elves of the Shadow. If that resolves, that will be my turn. So to my turn, I'll get a draw. Um, on my upkeep, I'll get a Comfort of Flowers trigger, a green mana, and I will use that green mana to play a Root Maze. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> more things, more things. So that's what that says. Um, I am going to go to combat then. I'm going to have... Thalia, Guardian of Thraben, come in over at Matt, and I am going to have the Kennedist come in over at Dylan again. No box. Take I'll two. I'll take the two. I will pass the turn. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. So you've got um, three cards for Cameron. How many cards? Um, Dylan and Matt. Just quick check. Just I three. got seven. Okay. Seven. All right. I will play a Deathrite Shaman. I will consider combat. I'm going to come in at Dylan with an Exalted Trigger. Sure, no box, I'll take two. 32. And that's, and that's my untap. Untap, draw card. I have a plateau that'll come in tapped and I can cast a Dragon's Rage Channeler with this Badlands. Is that okay? Seems good. All right, pass turn. Untap, draw. Pass the turn. Um, pass the turn. Okay. Um, I think I'm just going to do this anyway. I'm going to flash in an opposition agent. Knew it. I straight uh, up called that in my head. No one was here, but I, I looked at Jill and I said, opposition agent's coming. <laughs> to be fair, I, think, I thought it was David Mind Sensor, but same difference. Same thing. <laughs> that guy, yucky. Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, yeah good. Good. Fine. Yep. yeah up, up, up sounds good. We are so dead in 17 turns, just so everyone knows. <laughs> we are dead in two hours from now. All right. Hey, man, I'm gonna what, do mean, what do you mean we? I have a one three. I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm going to go to combat. I am going to set. I really wish I could cast my commando here, though. That's really the biggest bummer. Oh, that's a, that's yeah. illegal. That's against yeah. the <laughs> Um I'm going to have opposition agent come in over at Brandon. I am going to send Thalia down at Matt, and you won't see me making any more attacks this turn. <laughs> um, I accept your terms and I'll take three damage down to 34. I'll take two down to 33. And then Carpet of Flowers trigger on my second main, uh, targeting Dylan. We are going to use that to make a white mana, and we'll put all this junk into an Archon of Remiria. Hell yeah, we're so dead. Stunning, I love it. <laughs> double, double everything tapped, double rule of law. No searching, non creatures cost one more. I will pass. Beautiful. Oh, it's easy mode. All right, untap. Draw. Um, I'm just going to cast this Birds of Paradise. Okay. Untap. Draw a card. I have a tapped Forbidden Orchard. And also, I can, for three mana here, I believe it's three mana, cast my one spell for the turn, which will be a tapped Talisman of Dominance that will never work even <laughs> when it untaps. 
<laughs> um, but I do get a surveil trigger off of it, so I will surveil that is, off of that the is dragon incredible trigger. value. So that's very good. Um, this card is decent, but I didn't, <laughs> I'm not allowed to do literally anything anymore. So I'm 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 gonna bin it. It's a lion's eye diamond. I'll bin it right there in the graveyard. Um, okay, that's it. That's all I have. Past my turn. I'll flash in a motion thief because you know we don't have enough stacks taking it out. Oh, here I was thinking about drawing some cards. Um, you good with that one, Cameron? Yeah, I have nothing to say about that. Um, I have nothing to say about that either. I love it. Cool. That's that. It's good. Draw. I'm gonna play a. Tropical Island. Is the root maze, that's an enchantment, is that right? Correct. Okay. I think I can safely attack into Cameron because I'm really not, like, I'm unhappy if we're going to, if we're going to start depleting our, our, if you're going to block, what I'm saying is I'm happy if you block this with, like, getting any of them off the table. So I'm just going to send the three uh, at you, Cameron. Thinking. Thinking, thinking, I'll take three, down to 34. That would be my turn. Um, we'll go to mine. I'll get a draw. Okay, well that's great. Uh, let's go to combat. We're gonna swing Thalia down at map and Archon of Ameria and Opposition Agent over at Brandon. Um, so I've got five damage coming at me. Uh, that's correct. Five damage. And I could hypothetically double block the op edge. No, I'll just take take the five. That's fine. Go to 29. Take the five. We're then going to follow things up. I'll target uh, you then, Matt, with the, the two. Um, I'll make two white mana, and I'll use both that white mana to cast a Granite Magistrate. <laughs> oh, <fuck>. it. <laughs> I will pass the turn then. And sadly, we're in this sort of mode now. Um, so end step, we're going to cast something. Um, and I will eat one of... Um, I'll eat Matt's Marsh Flats with this death right to make a mana. So I can cast just cast a Tainted Pact. Ah. ah. I have nothing. Uh, I can't me. cast another spell this turn, so, yep. Cool. All right, so... You know what? <laughs> That's good enough. Really? It was an exotic. Fact. I mean, hey, it's got cycling. But the, the, exactly the like, top card of your deck, the top goes down. <laughs> yep, cool. Um, great. We got an exotic launcher for that, just for um, anyone keeping score at home. All right, untap. Upkeep, draw a card. This seems incredibly unintuitive, but we gotta do it. Cast this good track. Okay. Are the track resolves? Yeah. I'd like to swap it for your Dranath Magistrate. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, sure, you can have two Magistrates. Nice, I've got a pair of Magistrates. I'm, I'm just magistrate gonna move this to the high side, high. and I'm gonna use a lovely um, high quality um, proxy here. Um, that is not Yeah. And draw a card. Let's play a tapped underground sea as my land for turn. I will pay three mana to put Luris into my hand. Cast a one mana Chrome Mox, losing one life that can't be activated. Um, and Chrome Mox, okay? And it comes into play tap. Thank you. Chrome Mox ETB, I will um, pitch an Enlightened Tutor. Oh, sorry. Uh, and then also I need to be, I get a surveil trigger. I will surveil. I will put that into my graveyard Igataxian probe. All right. That's, that's, uh, let's see. Sorcery land artifact. Dragon's Rage is still not big and I have no good attacks. Um, pass turn. Thumbs up. Draw. So we've got a Gilded Drake as a blocker now. So we just passed the turn. Um, all right. Go to my turn. Get a draw. All right. I'm going to go to combat. Um, we are going to swing my two flyers in the air over at Brandon. I am also going to have Thalia come in down at Matt. Sure. I'll take the two. Get a 28. 
Um, great. I'm not gonna do anything with carpet of flower mana. I'm just gonna pass the turn. I love the art that you've done, Brandon. That's really good. Yeah, I went to um, art school for a good five years for that one. <laughs> um, all right. Well, we're gonna cast my commander paying uh, thusly. Kenrith, you say? Yes. I got nothing. I pass priority. I pass priority. Oh, the big man. Um, I'm so happy. That, that's, that's, that's it. That's all I wanted. Go ahead. Untap and draw a card. Play an island tapped and cast Luris. Can't one. cast any more spells, so I will pass turn. Uh, end step, I will Cyclonic Rift the off agent. Cyclonic so Rifting, the op agent, eh? Um, that's fine. I have no responses to that. So that will bounce. Drop it there. Ah, that's a scrub land. <laughs> yeah, that is a scrub land. Yep. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't mean Kenrith? Uh, I think, no, I, well, think he's, I think he's sure. <laughs> I, uh, it, the plan was that uh, you weren't going to be able to cast it again. <laughs> Um, no, no, I can very much cast <laughs> the response to whatever yeah. you're going to do. I'll play a, I'll play a uh, Verdant Catacombs and I'll rethink my life. <laughs> um, yeah. All right. No responses. No responses um, to that. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to pass. You're going to pass. All right, well, I'm just, I'm, I'm <laughs> casting it again. I'm just uh, your, Matt, Matt, you'll land into tap, mate. Oh, uh, yeah, of course. That's also yeah. true, yeah. Um, okay, any responses to Op Agent? Nope. Oh, yeah. Great. All right, we're gonna go to my turn. Um, draw a card. Ah, uh, ah, yes, okay. Finally, so we are going to have Carpet of Flowers. Target Matt, again, I guess Dylan also has two now. He still has- I have has three. Two. You have three? Big mumbo jumbos. All right, Dylan, we're going to target you. We're going to make three green mana. We're going to cast a Sylvan Library. Okay, that doesn't seem great. Um, we are going to go to combat. Uh, we are going to send five in the air over at Brandon. Um, and uh, yep. we are going to send um, another two. Um... You know what? I don't think it's worth getting Thalia tangled in there. Um, you know what? It is. Thalia coming down at Matt. Uh, yeah, I'll take the three. Uh, Matt, I can give you a 1-1 one, one if you want to block with my 1-1 one, one and one of your elves. Or uh, I guess you need to Thalia block with both of your strike, elves and a 1-1. Yeah. One, one. yeah, I... I if, if you triple block. I, I think I'm good. I, I, I need the mana. There'll, there'll be something that oh, will okay. unlock. Thank you there. All right. Very generous. I'll just um, try not to pull I'll, get a, I'll get a 19. I'll get a 19. <laughs> I have uh, no other plays. I will pass. Tippity tap. Triggity draw. Um, let's pick on Dylan's graveyard. Exile any your choice, please. Um, and I will cast this Morsel Hoarder. A what? <laughs> um, that's fair. That's that's fair. Um, <laughs> uh, it's a morsel hoarder. It's a six mana six four, which enters with two neg one neg one counters, and you may remove a neg one neg one counter to add a mana of any color. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it'll enter with um, two counters. Um, and that is my turn. Okay, go to me. Untap. Draw card. Play a Flooded Strand land tapped as my land for turn. And with Luris's ability, I can play a Lion's Eye Diamond for my graveyard no, you, tapped. No, you cannot. That's two Dranath Magistrates. I do not appreciate that. That's right. Yeah. The two the Dranath Magistrates say I can't cast. Thank you. Yeah, both of them are not very happy about that. Um, Isn't it like two negatives equals a positive, though? No, it's just four lots of finger waggling. Like, no, no, no. <laughs> I will go to combat. Um, Cameron, I'm going to come at you with Luris. 3-2 with lifelink. 
I'll take it down to 31. I'll gain four, go up to 34, and pass my turn. Not that. Roll for tap. We'll play a watery grave tap. You will not pay two life. We will pass the turn. Um, all right, we'll go to my turn. Uh, no Sylvan Library because of the... Whatchamacallit in play? You could if you wanted to. No, Shinthi. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Bad point. What's our plan then? Um, we are going to go to combat. Yep. Um, Brandon, I'm going to come back in the air at you for five. And um, Thalia, again, is going to come down over at Matt. Just before block, something to consider, Matt. I can put a counter on one of your guys because I've got a moss all over here. I forgot about that. I am incredibly tempted to like entice you into blocking and then just not put a counter on your guy, but I'm not going to do that to you. So I, think I, I should take the two. Yeah, I think taking the two is fine too. All right, are you taking the five then, Brandon? Yeah, I'm taking the five. I'm down to fourteen. Um, second main carpet of flowers targeting Dylan to make three black mana. Uh, use one of the black for a death right shaman, and then we will pass. <sighs> Tap. It's quite annoying, actually. Um, all right. Well, we're gonna take a game action here. We're gonna cast this Hermit Druid. Oh, sure. Ooh. Probably could give that haste if you wanted to, couldn't you? Yeah, could mm, give that something a go. to think about. I will. Um, I have no responses. I'm passing priority. I'll pass priority. I have no responses either. Mm -hmm. um, I will definitely consider giving it haste. I don't. I think you can win through. Because you still Not have to right cast now. another yeah, spell. If he gives it haste, if he gives him haste, like he still would need a way to get Thassa's Oracle into play then. If only, if only I had a Kenrith and five mana, that would be good. Do you have five mana? You, have, you need too. six mana, right? Um, You mean like one, two, three, four, five, six mana? There we go. Yeah, that's it. Mm. Um. um... Well, he's resolved now, right? So. Oh yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, I'm trying to think. I have, I have something in my hand, but it doesn't do anything. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I think if we don't, if anyone has anything to the hermitry, we we may be dead. So. Um, I'm nothing. going to give all my creatures. Um, give creatures haste. Yeah, my, our creatures too, though, right? That is correct. Okay, so your death right shaman, I think, Cameron. Wait, no, that's been in for a while. Never mind. <laughs> no, uh, it just came in this turn. Oh, so. nice. Sorry, your death right shaman's live, Cameron. Just so you know. Okay. Yeah, I, I'd, I'd considered that too, but I was hoping um, he'd forget. But sadly, teamwork <laughs> does make the dream work. Um, um, well, hold up. Now let me think. Does that change anything? It certainly does. Just don't do anything now. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you can true. wait until he flips over the thoracle. Maybe That's I should have true. texted you this privately so you didn't <laughs> tell him. <about> <laughs> okay. You know, we're, we're, uh, we're um, what's the word? I've, I've not like a... 500 IQ play, but like a 499 IQ play, I've tried to consider the options a little bit. So Boom. let's right. go ahead and activate um, Duty McGee. I don't think paying matters too much. Um, let's pay with this dude, if that's all right. Does oh, this happen? Yeah, you still, um, I think we counted a little bit because you, if I look correctly, I see four mana now. Um. Because it was one to give haste and one to activate, right? One, two, three, four, five. Oh yeah, I need one haste. Oh, sorry, so let me think. Um, okay. So if I do that, oh, is that still worth it? It might be. But who shoots first? Though? That's the problem. Hmm. Sorry, I still think this. Is, I mean, it won't be the way I want it to, but it still might work. Yeah, I don't know what's left over in your hand. I, I don't mean to talk you out of a player. Uh, in yeah, sorry. Yeah, no, sorry. I can't. I can't cast any of the spells. I've cast my hermit as, as my spell for the turn. Sadly, I actually think I can just pass the turn with this board state. That's that's what. Yeah, the, you're that's definitely what threatening a potential win very soon. Yeah, so. I'm just going to play the hermit druid, and I, I I already said that I'd give it haste, but I will just sit on that um, right. miscount and pass the turn. I'm next. going to pray for cyclonic rift as I've been doing for the past seven turns of this game. I, I had one of them. It was it, it worked real well. <laughs> I will draw a card. I have a tapped Godless Shrine to come into play tapped, and some combat. Cameron, I'll hit you with the Lurse. Hmm. Okay, I can't let you keep doing that. 
So I'm going to put either Swan Cannonist in front of that. Okay. Whew. So we'll trade, and I'll gain three life. Mm-hmm. I'll go up Don't to worry, 37. Still another another rule of law in play. <laughs> and that's it. I'll pass my turn. I'll have that. <clears throat> I'll drop the turn. My it. Dragon's Rage Channeler is a 3-2 now, if that is relevant to every, anyone. I'm pretty sure oh, it's three, a 3-3. Three, three. Three. Right, uh, exactly. Uh, yep, I played Booted Foothills uh, as land for turn. It comes in tapped because I know these things. Uh, and I will pass. Go to my turn. So Cameron, you can't activate death right now, just so you remember. No, I know. You need to, you need to be able to hold up a green mana so you can exile the Thoracle when need be. Dylan, how many things do you have? How many... Uh, <laughs> um, the flooded... Uh, oh, sorry, just checking the flood strands. Oh, no, that, that was, was last turn. Time. Yeah, that's last time you got it. This was yeah. this turn, yeah. Godless yeah. turn. What's your question, Cameron? How many islands do you have now? I have three islands. They're over here. You have three islands, and they're all over there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I also have three islands, for what it's worth. All right, I'm going to go to Wombat. I am going to swing five in the air over at Brandon. Yeah, I'll just take five, go to nine. So that's... All right, so Carpet of Flowers on my second main is going to make three white. And we'll go... Use that three white and one more for Thalia. Cast a Rule of Law. Just more of them now. I yep. will pass. Um, in your end step, I have actions. I'm going to make... Um, three mana. I'm going to eat a land of your choice, if that's fine, Cameron. Okay. Um, I'm going to make white mana, and I'm going to target myself to gain five life with Kenrith. Um, yeah, sure. What's your level now? I'm back up to 14, if that resolves. Okay. Yeah, um, I'll untap and take my turn. I'll keep draw. We just give it a go, don't we? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We definitely have the mana now, so that's fine. I'm only casting one spell this turn. Lands and artifacts enter tapped. Everything costs one extra. Can't search. Can't draw cards. All right, um, we're going to activate the guy. No responses. I'm good. Yep, me too. All right. Um, well, my entire deck will go to my guard, but do a really quick flip through. So we got some cards here. It's a fate stitcher. That seems important. Yeah. There's a knock amoeba as well. Oh, something's gonna happen with that. Relevant abilities. There was the thoracle that we just flipped over. Oh there. shit. Fucking A. What? Yeah, we're gonna be doing I, this for um, I tapped in totally incorrectly, dude. Did you not leave green open? No, I, I tapped. Open, what are those lands? It's a tundra and a fucking scrub land. <laughs> <laughs> <Bitch>. <laughs> Oh, we're just so incredibly powerful at Magic the Gathering. Um, I'm just gonna oh, have this wow, Narcomeme. Fuck, fucking I'm gonna, moron. I'm gonna have this Narcomeme oh. trigger come in yep. and do Narcomeme. Um, is that okay? Um, I'm gonna respond to it. Just want to ask a question. Is the opposition agent um, like a main? No, it's the replacement effect. You don't have to choose. Okay. What do you mean? Yeah, yeah. Um, I think Matt's suggesting he can help if he can search. But it's alright. That's fine. I pass priority. Yep, I get nothing. Um, so this knock maybe triggers in the stack, just acknowledging Matt's and then after that I'll probably no, want to do some other things. No, I'm, still, I'm still trying to think. I'm still trying to think. Mother! Yeah, I have Psych Rift, but um, that um, doesn't do it here. That's helpful. You can, um, yeah, if you bounce Kenrith right now, he's still in, uh, no. There is a knock, knock on me, okay, um, for, the, for the sake of um, game, I guess, the if you were to bounce Kenrith to my hand right now, then like, I would just put it in, put the Thoracle into play. Yeah, that's what I, yeah, that's why. So I it doesn't, it doesn't yeah. quite work. It doesn't really do anything. Yeah, I think if you had the Psych Rift, you could have just bounced Kenrith during your turn. Well, no, like what, 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 what yeah. happened was I realized too late and you were already starting to mill your deck that Psych Rift, I would have had to do Psych Rift right before oh, yeah, you I start see. milling your deck. 
and then that way Kenrith's in your hand. Your deck. Plus Thali is out anyway. That's the sacrifice for buff three. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can't. No, I, I have. Uh, well, I have three mana. Yeah, the death right. Three, yeah, that, but, yeah. So I would still have three mana to be able to do that. But technically, you had already started flipping over your library. I was a little bit too late. Okay, but, so all right, that. yeah. So Narcomiba trigger happens. Yeah, big big knocks. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so Narcomiba's yeah. in play. What next? Um, we're just going to activate Kenrith on Tharsa's Oracle Pain. Um. I think I really like it. I'm gonna to have to read the game anyway. Um, I will pay with a removal of a morsel hoarder counter to return Thus Circle to play with Kenrith. Anyone have any graveyard exile shit? Sadly, no. No. Nope. Yeah. I'm good. Cool. Game game. Game. GG. Good shit. Good game. That was a long grind you went. Holy hell, so much shit going on. <laughs>